good evening, yeah. internet. Yeah. Uh, about two weeks ago, we did some uh, key casting with the what's this brand? Multipick. Multipick uh, casting material, and uh, that worked like a charm. But uh, the material that uh, you knew you use for the casting, or for, for making the cast, that's the magic sauce. So we haven't got a clue what that is. So we're going to try to use different materials to get the same results. Same goes for the metal. We don't know what the metal actually is. So we sourced uh, from some quite shady Russian website. Uh, we sourced something that they call rosewood and we have some wood metal. Uh, we did figure out that the official clamp from Lockmasters, this set, that has uh, wood metal. So we, we know this kind of should work. So we're gonna try the rose metal first to figure out if that actually works. To uh, uh, to cut down on the variables, we're gonna use the uh, in the first stage we're gonna use the uh, molds that we made two weeks two weeks ago to cast a key with the rose metal. To so we know that the rose after that we know that the rose metal works. If that works, we're gonna use something else for the uh, cast making material. Jeez. Well, we uh, looked at the first cast key with the new rose metal, and that didn't work. But after closer inspection, we uh, assessed that the uh, that the mold was not completely correctly lined up. So we're going to try it again with a mold that we think is now lined up. So again with the rose metal, take two. Yeah. Okay, uh, we wait a bit, not too long, but we hope that's enough for it to harden. We. That looks like a key, doesn't it? Yeah. More key. It's uh, not cold, but for like that. And it works. it works. Okay. Oh. And <laughs> definitely not unsmooth. Okay. So the initial failure was uh, operator error. And this definitely works. Yeah. So what happened, uh, I'll try to show you. Is it photo? Does photo. Yeah, this is the, uh, the errors one. This is the one we made two weeks ago. So this is the, with the uh, shady Russian metal, that apparently works. If you look at this key, at the end, this is correctly done. And if we turn it over, then we see there's a ledge here. So the both, so the mold was lined up, not correctly. Uh, the metal probably, the, the metal part uh, probably correctly, but we assume that this was a bit off. About half a mil, so we didn't really notice that. So we corrected that and now, first, second try, it actually works. Okay, so this metal works. And now we're gonna try a new casting. Yep. Now uh, we assessed that the rose metal actually does work if you line up your, uh, uh, your, your cast correct. And now we're gonna get creative because we also don't wanna use this cast material because it had magic sauce. We don't like magic sauce. So we're going for squid. Uh, this is the uh, backbone of a squid that has uh, a particular uh, 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 form and shape and density. And we hope we can use this as a casting thing. Uh, we start off uh, not with the BKS because uh, we first want to figure out if tolerances actually do work. And we don't have a holder for it. So we're going for this... Uh, standard cast lock that Walter happened to have in his bag. So, I'm gonna, well first I'm gonna get this off, because I don't want 15 keys meddling about. Well, here we go. Boom. So, a key that we obtain for just a short minute. Like I said, we don't have fancy holders for it, so it's gonna be like this. Don't break it. <laughs> okay, it should be. Hmm. Oh, it... of course I want 
zero slack on the outside. I'm wiggling it a bit. I must say I don't feel very un. I'm gonna make a slit here so we can align it. Ish. When we put it back together, because like I said, we don't have a mold uh, holder for it. So we have to visually line it up. Okay, let's take it apart. I can see this happening. Yeah. Yeah. Let's uh, prepare some of the uh, metal we tried before. Line it up and see how this goes. Hello. Okay. Okay. The stuff we do for science. Uh -oh. We have a leak. Uh, mm, I don't think we have a leak. Uh, oh. I think it uh, just it spilled a bit. Yes. Okay. Fine. Now the question is, is there enough in there with all this leakage? So... Mm, just wait. Yeah, I'm gonna wait till this looks hard and nished. It's okay. clearly still liquid. Transition. Uh, we're back with the uh, uh, cuttlefish bone, because I said squid, that was wrong. This is a cuttlefish. And I hope enough material got in Whoa! This is a key. <laughs> it looks like a key. This is, looks very much like a key, yeah. Okay, let's try to get this out in a... And... Ah, f okay. So, there's some material that came with it. So I don't think we can... It's not reusable. Well. <laughs> and we need... St this needs some rework, you see? There's some... There's some leakage here. Yeah. But... Okay. Without looking at the actual key, I'm gonna see if I can do this a bit. Ow. The hobby bob way. The hobby bob way. So the both pieces of the mold weren't aligned completely, so there was some leakage. But that's very. Uh, uh, thin, so I think this should kind of maybe hopefully work ish. <laughs> Boom. Okay, it wasn't. Uh, it was yeah. If it goes in, I believe this is the one. Okay. Uh, that's. Uh, Came out to the take. Uh, apparently, yeah. Which either means it doesn't work or my mold wasn't pushed together hard enough. The fact that it leaked out here, I would suggest it's that it's, it's, it's uh, operator. Yeah. Mold we used two weeks ago. Uh, the mold we made for the uh, dome diamant. And we tried again our new rose metal that we sourced from the shady shady Russian source. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, there you go. Ta -ta -ta -ta. Of course, with this tool lining up, it's not. Ooh. We have Shiny. a shiny. We do have a hole in the middle. That's not supposed that's, to be there, is it? Uh, but that's not a problem. Our first one also had a hole. Yeah. Uh, there's also here some. Not sure if that'll work, but we'll see how far we go. I think it's still quite warm, because that's quite massive. <laughs> yeah. Quite smooth. So that works. Okay, so what did we learn? Always order from shady Russian sites. <laughs> and with that, we'll leave you.